welcome back to another video. I can't believe I'm playing this again of Sekiro. I don't know what I'm doing with this game. I don't know if this is like a series or I'm just kind of flirting with the idea of playing this game from time to time. Honestly, I think I just really want to face the first boss of this story of this game and see what it's really all about. Typically, you have the first boss that is meant to kind of kill you and then you start from scratch and build your way up, which we kind of had that. But I want to have I want to face the first real boss and just see what that's like. Then I'll be content, okay? One thing I've really been enjoying about this game is the traversal. Absolutely incredible. I have no idea where I'm supposed to go. Am I going crazy or what? Oh, sh- What? Ooh. Okay. <laughs> this game is so different, dude. Like, it's- it's- When you compare it to like Elden Ring and stuff and Bloodborne and all those fan favorite sorts of games, this truly is different. We're going to collect this and we're going to play it safe. You're the son of Owl. What happened? Thieves at Hirata Estate. You must hurry. The divine error. What year is it? What year? An odd question. Tell me. It's the year of the Dragon Spring Pilgrimage. The Dragon Spring Pilgrimage? That was three years ago. What is this? The sculptor mentioned in old memory i don't remember any of this but it appears this is the past yeah so this um if you guys recall we're kind of reliving a memory of sorts and so here we are let me just collect this the dowsing powder medicine for treating burns heals the burn status of normality and for a time, decreases burn buildup, increased burn resistance, and reduces damage from incoming burn attacks. So, what are you trying to tell me? We're going to go against fire enemies? Yep, they've got torches. That's exactly what it's telling me. I don't know if breaking this will do anything for us, but I want to see if I can kind of play the stealth game here. There's no need to... There's no need to get into the danger zone when we can avoid all that danger. All right? I can easily kill this guy if I sneak up behind him. Like that. That's right. All right, so spirit emblems are required to activate prosthetic tools and are consumed each time these abilities are used. The spirit emblems can be obtained from defeating enemies in the world and purchased from sculptures idols. If you pass near them, they will find their way to you. Oh, crap. Alright, so that's how we use- Oh, fuck. Hey, hey! What? That's it? Oh my god! How did this guy just hit me with a three-piece combo? Wait, what? Who saw me? Fuck this, dude. I'm not gonna be playing like this. I'm not gonna be playing like this. I refuse to play by your rules. Okay, um, hold on a second here. Take a little pellet. Never hurt nobody. No, 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 do not call back reinforcement, please. All right, some of these weaker foes, I could just keep spamming the attack and... And that'll be just fine. All right, so I could have hooked onto that. 
That's what I was trying to figure out. All right, we've got the main entrance here. We've also got a little side skirt area, which I don't know if we should go there. Let me see. Before I go on top, let me check this area out. Ooh. Moist to a pop. One slice and you're dead. So far, what I've been admiring about this game is just the, the overall setting. I, I really, really enjoy it. Amiibo balloon filled with uh, fountain head water, imbued with the blessing of fortune. If one pops the vibrant green uh, Amiibo balloon and prays those its water splashes upon will have a higher chance of obtaining items. Amiibo means aquatic life or life born of the water. The Ashinots uh, consider the fountainhead water itself to be worthy of worship. Uh, so should I... If I go to equipment or inventory... Oh shit. Okay. Can I swim in this game? I think I can, right? Okay, good. That's friggin' cool. Oh, that's a fish. Okay, that's that I think that's what was actually spotting me earlier. Ooh, we've got some Who's that? Uh hello? Oh shit. Should I try and kill that thing? So the treasure carp scale to the average person it's just a beautiful scale but there are some who exalt a certain master who consider these scales among the most precious things in the world for this reason collecting them could be worthwhile all right i thought killing that fish might have made this guy here possibly talk to me i guess not all right let's get back to the regular scheduled program today i'm gonna go back over there seems to be another fish underwater so we're going up here Let's see what this is all about. Oh my god, there's so many of them. Oh, there's a safe spot there as well. Ooh. That was dumb. That was really dumb. Oh, crap. I'm gonna climb up top. The traversal is so freaking cool. He's got a bow and arrow. He's got a flaming bow and arrow. Sorry, Bob! No, you've got to be kidding me. Okay, hold on. Time out, time out. Rest, rest. <sighs> okay, hold on. Let me rest. That's fine. Holy cow. Let's try this again. There it is. Alright, now we're gonna rush over there. That's right. That's freaking right. Take this guy out. Perfect. That worked out beautifully. That's actually what I was expecting the first time around. So we've got oil, plain oil. When the jars break, the oil covers everything nearby. Enemies dozed in oil are easily set alight, causing them to take additional vitality damage from fire attacks and making them more vulnerable to the burn status abnormality. Okay. That's pretty common. Self-explanatory. Gotta be careful here. Oh, come on, dude. I'm, in, I'm literally inside the fucking fog. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna die here. I'm gonna freaking die here. Oh, 
Gotta stay focused. Okay, this is exactly the same thing the, the merchant was talking about at the end of the last episode, remember? When everything was ablaze and they broke in and then they saw us. This is literally, we're just reliving that it seems like. I could be wrong, this is just me speculating right now. God. Perfect. More pellets. Oh boy. Hmm, this is not good. What the f seriously? Really? Oh my god. My God. Now we've got to play this nice and calmly. Easy does it. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to let them come to me. Oh, crap. Okay, now we're going to retreat. What? Oh my god. Oh, we're playing this. Playing this slowly. Oh my god. Tell me they can't hit each other? That's bogus, dude. Fuck! Oh my god! Shit. Oh my god. This game is crazy. Why are we hugging the wall right now? It's the last thing we need to be doing right now. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna lose my marbles. What the hell was that? Impossible. Who hit me in midair? Is that a merchant? No, that's not a merchant. That's a drunk man who is now a dead man. Okay, I think the flame barrel, an iron barrel that spews fire, can be fitted to the shinobi prosthetic to become a prosthetic tool. It is difficult to control the rage-filled red eyes with the power of man alone. However, a fire-based weapon could be a means of resisting them. They are said to fear fire above all else. Dosing powder, medicine for treating burns. I'm kind of happy that it tells you the description of every item every single time. Not again. Okay, that's dealt with. That's good. Should we be uh, searching all these little... Little rooms just in case? Oh. What is that? Oh, those are probably just... Uh, okay, from the fallen bodies. I still haven't used any sort of prop. Um, I guess to like distract the enemies really haven't been using that to my to my advantage 
I don't know if I should, to be honest. Alright, cool. Oh, God. Come on, dude. No, you've got to be fucking kidding me. Okay, that jump attack is pretty good. I like that. The jump attack seems to be pretty good. It's, dare I say, maybe even faster than a regular attack. Worthless bastards. Hello. Uh, uh, you are a shinobi, if, if I'm not mistaken. Take the shinobi axe from, from the temple. And split their skulls wide open. Please. This guy means business. I feel bad for him. Hey, okay, should I be? This is the perfect spot. got two there. Why can I eavesdrop? Are they too far away? We burning this temple next for? No. Leave it. Go on to the next one. But if there's any offerings, we could give them to Lord Juzo. Enough! We don't take from Buddha. How many times do I have to tell you before it sinks into your sick skull? Please, don't get angry at me, boss. I'm sorry my score's so sick. Yeah, that jump attack is much better. I mean, I don't know. I could be wrong, but it feels like it's just faster. You don't take from Buddha? Well, don't mind if I do. The Shinobi Axe of the Monkey, a heavy black iron axe used by Shinobi, can be fitted into the Shinobi prosthetic to become a working prosthetic tool. This boorish axe is used less for cutting and more for breaking things. With its weight once the favorite weapon of a shinobi known as the Bounding Monkey of the Sunken Valley. It was lost along with his left arm. Well, that's a good tool to find. <laughs> Gotta be very careful. Very careful with the chickens now. Shit. God. Shut up, shut up. So far, I don't think they alert the enemies. I mean, maybe if they're closer, yeah, but... Okay, spoke too soon. Ah, uh, fuck. Spoke too soon. Spoke too soon. I refuse to die to a fucking chicken! I really, really need to save. Oh my goodness. Is there somebody there? Let me find out. Yeah, there is. Hey, good sir. Are you a looter too? That's the merchant. Good sir, <laughs> you look like a shinobi. I think. That is the merchant. Are you looking for something? Well, in any case, <laughs> I found this place first. Hmm? <laughs> so, keep your eyes peeled out there, huh? And, uh, you know, don't let the door hit you on the... the way out. Oh, by the way, while I was on my way here, I saw a three-story pagoda on top of some cliff. It was a fine pagoda. Really fine. I bet there's some kind of treasure kept in there. <laughs> Gotta be. That's what hmm. I think, at least. Alright, so, 
Let's see. If he's trying to loot that, are we able to go inside? Hmm. Let me let me take a look at this remnant here. What is a villain? Hey, open up. Open up or else. I can hear you whispering in there. If you don't surrender peaceably now, you're going to regret it later. Hey, can you hear me? Peaceably, is that a word? Shouldn't it be peacefully? Hold on, let me just see see what's over here. The bundled Jizzle statue, a small Buddha. Abound in red cloth, raised in prayers between one palms to restore nodes of resurrective power. Just to express feelings. Okay. There's a lot of items that we've been discovering. A lot of which we have to yet find out what they all do. And I love this whip. It's so cool. Clutch. I mean, I got hit, but whatever. Fuck it. We've got more pellets. I'm really hoping there's an upgrade that allows us to replenish more health with, with the pellet intake. Let's see if there's another one of these guys here. I don't think so, but you just never know. Who, who are you? I'm not a thief. Uh, you're, you're the young lords. Oh, thank goodness. Honorable Shinobi, those filthy bandits are after the young lord. They've already climbed the hill and set the estate on fire. It looked as if the young lord had no way to escape. I beg of you, Shinobi. Please rescue the young lord. I entrust this to you. The Antidote Powder, a powerful antidote concocted by the Sunken Valley clan. Heals status abnormal uh, abnormalities, poisons, and temporarily increases poison. Re oh, that's cool. So that's I like pray a... It is of help. Thank you. Nice. Perfect. That's definitely going to come in handy. Hopefully we don't have to use it, but surely it'll come in handy. Alright, these guys got shields. That's just fucking great. That is just great. Hold on. Maybe, maybe a little ash here, what? Yep. Maybe I ought to leave him back. Back there. Yep, 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 yep. Oh my god, I need to save, I need to save. Like drastically right now. Like pronto. We have a save over there? Yes we do. Oh, that's a freaking boss probably. Oh Bro, it doesn't even matter right now. Like I, I don't care. Could you please just turn around? Kill them? I'm gonna die here. I'm gonna die here. Thrust attacks cannot be blocked, but they can be deflected. I'm gonna fuck. I mean, I mean, what do you want me to do right now? I'm out. I'm out. I'm out. I'm out. I don't know what you're saying. I'm out. I'm out of here, bro. Stop playing. At some point, they got to stop looking for me, right?
This is some bullshit. Bro, get out of here. Resurrect. Ow. Oh, shit. I need to take that guy out, bro. This is bullshit, dude. Like, what, what, what do you want? How, how do you even finish this? All right, so we're back here. I've had to skip a decent amount of enemies to get ourselves back here safely. Because I think we have to take out all the enemies in order to unlock the fog that is ahead. And so here they come. Really? Seriously? Wait, does he s Whoa! this fucker, bro. What the fuck? Bastard. Fuck off! Rot Essence. The Timid Maid. Somewhere a painted cough rings out continuously. The coughing and wheezing sounds of an old woman deeply worried about her beloved master. Owning this item reduces one's chances of receiving unseen aid. The dragon rot. The more one with the power of the dragon's heritage dies, the more a sickness known as dragon rot spreads throughout the world. Dragon rot is not caused by resurrection. It has a chance to occur only when the wolf tr truly dies repeatedly. The more rot essence Wolf has, the lower the chances of receiving. Well, that fucking sucks. Mm. What is it? Seems to me your battle sense has returned. You're more like a shinobi than before. If only a little. Take this. There's a red Azeteric text, a book of secrets that details a variety of techniques employed by a shinobi grants the ability to learn a shinobi style skills. Within the text are the innermost secrets of shinobi arts, such as attacks performed in the air and hiding one's body to avoid detection. Such moves could never be practiced by samurai. Is it? Shinobi techniques recorded within are fighting techniques that cannot be performed by samurai. Hmm. Whether you make use of them or not is up to you. Shinobi aren't the only ones with their own fighting techniques. Owning an 
Zoretic. A Zoretic text of a combat style will allow its skills to be acquired in the sculptor's idle skill menu. Each enemy defeated provides skill experience. Skill points are acquired once enough experience is gained, which can be spent to unlock skills. Some skills can also be earned or learned by obtaining items or defeating enemies. So can I speak to this guy and... <coughs> What's wrong? <laughs> Dragon rot. The stagnation overflows and spreads. A disease that leads eventually to death. What are you talking about? You don't need to worry about me. I'm not normal, you see. It's difficult for me to speak now. Ask Emma about the rest. Hmm. Well, so what just happened back there? Did I just completely lose everything? Have you seen the sculptor lately? Yes. He's... All I know is what Dogen told me long ago. That the dragon's heritage can bestow the power of resurrection. However, it is not any ordinary power. Repeated use leads to stagnation, which will eventually reach a point where it overflows. This causes those who do not have the power to become sick. A disease known as dragon rot. He knew much about it, but mm. even so, he was unable to determine a cure. Forgive me. Is there a way to treat this dragon rot? I do not know. However, it must be stopped. I am unsure. But the first step is to look through my mentor's research and see if I can discover a way. Thank you. I'd like to make a request. What is it? Please show me your face. What? Hmm. This white mark, is it a birthmark? No. Then, that must mean it appears on those who have received the dragon's heritage. Or perhaps, it's a symptom. Hmm. Are you done? Yes, I'm sorry. That was rather rude of me. Goodbye. So what do I do now? I mean... If I go here, I, <laughs> the, acqu uh, the acquire skills menu has been unlocked in the sculptor's idol menu. New skills can be learned by spending skill points. Acquire skills. New skills can be acquired by spending skill points in the skills menu. New combat styles can be learned through obtaining a Zoretic. A Zor a Z I don't know how to say that word. Text for each style. There are three types of skills. Combat, Shinobi, and Latent skills. Combat arts must be equipped to be used, but Shinobi arts and Latent skills are always in effect upon being acquired. Okay, so acquiring combat arts, Whirlwind Slash, a spinning attack that can hit several enemies at once. Acquire Shinobi martial art, Mikiti counter. Enables one to counter enemy thrust attacks by stomping down on the enemy. Hmm. Okay, this is interesting. Mid-air deflection. Not enough skill points. Okay, so where can I? Hold on. Combat arts. Combat arts are special attacks based on the strength of fighting style that they belong to. They must be equipped in the equipment menu to be used and cannot be learned and can be learned through the skill menu or found in a special text. RB while holding LB. Travel. Let's see. Can I travel back over to where we were just at? Alright, so we're back at the outskirts. Um, I don't know if I missed the thing where I could have traveled through the fog back there. Where we were. Or maybe we should just revisit that later on. I don't know. But I'm assuming maybe it's just best for us to continue our path this way just just in case because i don't know i feel like I mean, this game is difficult in general but that that felt that felt very difficult all right so we're gonna go this way i don't feel safe with that big bastard just tied up next to us i'd rather not be gravely injured just before the war begins ah if the worst happens only choice is to use fire those red eyes fear fire. That's what the Lord's proclamation says. 
proclamation. What a joke. Ashina sure has a funny way of preparing for war. Let's see if I can sneak up behind him here. Grab attacks. Grab attacks cannot be deflected. There is no way to avoid taking serious damage once grabbed. But if one jumps or sprints away, grabs can be avoided. Some grabs can also be avoided when a well-timed step dodge is des uh, in a desired direction. Hold B to sprint. Uh. My boy. This man's a wrestler. <gasps> no! Oh! Oh my God! Press the A button, I swear. And now I'm dead. But not for long, bastard. Not doing it. Not. <laughs> okay, run. I'm sorry for quitting. I I I, I got to take a break here. I ha oh, God. I have to. I'm I'm gonna take a rest. I I have to rest. <laughs> this guy <in> is. <laughs> this guy is fucking moves, bro. This is just fucking ridiculous. Alright, there's gotta be a better way to fucking kill this thing. fall off I think you have to defeat him if, if you want to open that up right
really did it. <laughs> oh my god. The prayer bead. A loose prayer bead offering four of the metal sculptures idols will increase the maximum vitality and posture. Currently, the wolf has two beads. And only two. The latent skill that increases the healing effect of recovery items. Medicinal knowledge is, uh, knowledge is vital for shinobi survival. Receiving wounds in battle is inevitable. The only way to learn such techniques is to be gravely injured. Okay, so if I go here... Okay, so that that should help me. Good. Now that enemy, I'm, I'm gonna go back. Just because I know that enemy is not going to respawn. It's, it's kind of like a miniature boss. So it is quite literally impossible. I'm going to save. I'm going to rest. Get, every, oh, get all my stuff back. And then I can take out the first two guys out. Which should be relatively easy. And then continue on to that fog. There was a fog upstairs that... I think once you defeat them, it's unlocked. Yeah. Might have been the same thing that was happening to us in that other area we had to defeat the guy with the spear and we couldn't so the fog was not unlocking but now it's unlocked upstairs as you can see yep just as i thought the night jar monocular a bamboo tube used to see distant objects my shinobi already have good vision looking through this tube with an eye enables you to see even further Guarding the rooftops uh, of Ashina Castle, the sharp eyes on the lookout for any would-be trespassers. Not much escapes the eyes of the night jar. Oh my god. Oh my god. The gourd seed. Seed from which healing waters continuously springs forth. This twisted gourd of medicinal waters is known throughout uh, Ashina since long ago, but it was an extraordinary healer. I gotta give the seeds to Emma. I'm gonna be spotted here. This guy did not see me? Entire squad is here. What is going on? Back away, man. This is crazy, dude. Is this the guy with the little freaking bell? You ought to be shitting me, man. Where's that general? 
Oh, there he is. At least I can get a, a free one on him. Here we go. doing this I'm not gonna cry I'm not gonna start crying here and I'm not gonna let my ego get the best of me I'm not gonna get my ass kicked for an ego I'm just, just not doing it I will not let my ego be the death of me see I could have just snuck behind him but I didn't listen I should have just snuck behind him like this not even that bad you ain't that bad okay I gotta go now See you later, dude. Where's the general? Alright, he's there. I gotta take him out. Oh, he's got two again. Really? Oh, so you can't cheap shot him. Okay. Well, that sucks. Oh, we've got a save right here. Please. Don't take fall damage. Thank God. All right. Yeah, I'm going to take a rest here. Absolutely. This game tells me every time I play it. I've only played it twice, but this tells me that I'm getting old. Made her for grappling. Hunger. Yeah, I know that. It just tells me that my reflexes are not what they once were. Oh, what is that? Holy crap. What do I do? <laughs> You've got to be kidding me. This world is absolutely relentless. Oh my god. Dude. That better not be the boss. This is some bullshit! stupid this is so so stupid bro what in Snapseed. 
need uh, a few more seeds that make a loud noise. If you snap them, uh, useful for breaking the effect of illusion techniques. If an illusion occurs, it is because someone cracked it. To crush the phantoms and return to reality, one must defeat the creator of the illusion. Well, that's great. Best I get out of here. Maybe it's best we get out of here. Oh, it's pissed. Oh, it's really pissed. Oh, my gosh. Gatchin's. Gachin's sugar. The high Senopu priest gave this candy to a band of short but adept assassins. Suppresses sound and presence for a time, making uh, the user harder to detect. Bite the candy and take. Okay. So, kind of for stealth, I, I would assume. I think I should probably go back and, and, and go to Emma and, and see what's going on with all this because I feel like I need some upgrades, you know? I don't think we have enough for upgrades just yet, but. Catalog scrap, a page torn from the Ashina herb catalog, a comp uh, comp compendium of flowers and herbs. Snap seed naturally grows in ravines and deep valleys. According to the denizens of the sunken valley, such places are appropriate for offering oneself in marriage to the great serpent. If one wishes to become a bride, they must enter the belly of the serpent in the valley. Oh, God. So. Hold on, actually, let me let me take this. Yo, that that is crazy. That reminds me of the world serpent. Let me see if this if this guy re responds. Reminds me of the world serpent from God of War for some reason. Yeah, he responds. That's best. Oh no, he dropped the money. Alright, so it is to my knowledge that we are very close to the to the first boss. Technically the second boss, but the first official boss. I know that if I continue, this video is going to turn from an hour and a half of recording to like three hours. Just because of all the fails that it's, it's about to occur. I, I know it's coming. I think the last video of this game that I will be doing is after I face this boss that is coming up. And then I'll kind of gauge if this is something I want to commit to. Right now, I'm just having fun with it. Uh, this game is... I have to say, man, this might be my favorite from software game. I haven't played all of them, but I just, I love the setting. It's incredible. And it's, it's very different. I mean, you didn't even have to create a character. The story is kind of easy to follow and the combat is phenomenal and it just looks beautiful. I really, really enjoy this game. But let me know if you guys would like to see more. Drop the video a like if that's something you guys are into. Thank you for tuning in and hanging out and I hope you guys enjoyed. I'll catch you later.